test mode. A great feature that literally saved our asses over the years that we are making installations. To get into a test mode, you have two options. Either you use two hardware buttons that are on the front panel or you enter our web configuration tool. To start with a hardware option, press either top or down button on your device and you can scroll through effects available. It will be red, green, blue, white dimming and a snake pattern. It's also important to disconnect your PC from the controller and also any DMX or ARTnet signal sources. A SD card also has to be removed and then you can enter a test mode with the two hardware buttons. Second option or if you would like a software option is to enter our web configuration tool. Before that it's important to change the IP address of your PC manually. To enter the web configuration tool type in the IP address of your device into your favorite web browser. In default IP address of our devices is this. You type in the IP address of your device into your favorite web browser and a web configuration tool opened. There find a all settings tab at the top. Scroll down a bit and you will find a testing section. Here similar to the hardware buttons you got several patterns available for testing which are again red dimming, green dimming, blue and all dimming or white dimming. Also available is a snake pattern so that you can check the signal flow on your strip. It's very important while testing in a software version or, or software mode to hit stop test button. Remember test mode has the highest priority of all the modes available so if you want to hit the stop test button other modes won't work correctly. It's a good practice to run a test every time you are either finishing or starting with an installation so that you can find out soon if you choose the right type of the strip or if you set up a correct color order of your strip. 